do you remember that vision you had before you started this business? Remember when you imagined that every day you would wake up in the morning so excited to make content, so excited to serve these dream clients, so excited to really fulfill your bigger mission and your bigger purpose? Well, what happened? Because every morning, maybe you wake up and you don't feel as excited. Maybe you're actually dreading to serve certain clients. Maybe you don't feel totally aligned with your bigger mission. So what happened? The reality is what happens to many content creators, what happens to many entrepreneurs is that they invest in programs or they invest time into books, into videos telling you that you need to be a certain way. You need to follow this perfect script, this perfect step-by-step -step process in order to reach your goals. When you do that, you become more stuck in your left brain and you're not as true to who you are. You're not as in alignment. But when you realize that this game we're playing does not have concrete rules like that, that's when you fully step into your power. Think about it. You don't need to have perfect thumbnails. I watch YouTubers in my own niche and they don't have these perfect thumbnails. They don't have perfect lighting, perfect SEO, but they are true to who they are. And that's where the magic happens. People think they're working with an algorithm, but what you're really working with is human psychology, human emotions. So if people connect with you, they will stay more throughout the video. And if they connect with you, they'll actually go through your funnel, even if it's not perfect. So let go of thinking you need the perfect funnel, the perfect SEO, the perfect offerings before you can make this happen and focus more on being true to who you are. How exciting is that? Is that by being true to who you are, you get to have more success. You get to live your dream life. I was looking at my own channel and I was so surprised because my videos that brought in the most clients and the most views were videos where I was being true to me. One of them was a fun, playful skateboard video where I wasn't even talking about entrepreneurship and content creation. I was just being me. And people saw that and they were like, wow, I want that for myself. I want to be connected to my true self like Ari is. I want to be the creator of my life. And so they stuck around on my channel and they eventually became paying clients. And that's how content really converts, is by being you, not by, not by being someone who you're not. We have enough of those in this world. Be more of who you are. And so I really want you to revisit why you started this in the first place. What's the real reason you started your business? And get more connected to that. Get more excited by that. And let go of the to-do list. Oh, I need to do A, B, C before I can get X, Y, and Z result. No, you get to be more you. And then when you, when you do that, the strategy will fall into place. I'm not saying that strategy is not important. I'm not saying don't have a funnel. I'm not saying don't have an offer, but I'm telling you that stuff will fall into place when you're more of who you are. When I started Ari the Creator, I didn't know how to create a website, but I was so activated. I was so excited that I figured it out in three weeks and I'd never done it before. I wasn't tech savvy, but I watched videos and I found a way and my excitement, I remember being in my college dorm room and putting together my website for the first time. And I remember how it just came together and I didn't even want to go to sleep because it just excited me having that vision and just trusting in myself, trusting in the process brought this to life. And the same thing will happen for you too. Whether you're just starting out or whether you've already started, that will get you to the next level. Isn't that super exciting? And so I really want you to connect to who you really are and ask yourself, okay, have I been embodying this when I show up online, when I show up for speaking engagements, whatever it is that you do to get your word out. And if not, I really encourage you to go inward, you know, spend some time by yourself, like kind of like have an affair by yourself, if you will, and just fall in love with you and what makes you authentic and bring that light when it's time to create content again, bring that light on here and that will grow your business. You know, these past couple weeks, I haven't been creating as much content, but I've been growing my business because I've been focusing more on me. And I think that it sends out a frequency into the universe and it brings people to you because even though I wasn't creating as much content these past couple weeks, I was still attracting potential clients because I was still showing up at in-person events, being who I am. And people radiate, like they, it's like they resonated with that. It, I radiated this light and I was a magnet. And when you really activate this part of you, I'm telling you, life becomes magical. Life becomes like a game. And again, there are no rules to the game. You get to create the rules. You are the creator of your life. And so when I say that, just because you see someone else in your niche following, you know, this step-by-step this -step system, maybe they have a certain funnel in place. That doesn't mean that you have to have that as well. You want to have a funnel 
a business, you want to have content that's in alignment with you and is also what your target audience wants and needs. So you want to find the intersection at that circle. And a lot of people are creating content that their target audience wants and needs, but that's not in alignment. And so there's no overlap. And so they don't feel as aligned. They don't feel as good. And that leads to burnout. That leads to people quitting. That, le that leads to people going back to their nine to five job. But I'm telling you, you can really, like when you step into this, like life really does become magical. I'm about to move into a new property that is literally my dream property. And I'm so excited. I'm investing in mentors. I'm going to events and I live life on my terms. And I'm not perfect. I'm still working on this, but oh gosh, just everything feels, I would rather like, like here's the thing, like when you do this, you start to make more money and you have to let go of the, the outcome. So I'm not attached to making more money. That's the thing, I'm, I let go of that, but it comes in because I'm more of who I am and I'm more focused on that and that comes as a byproduct. Whereas before, I wasn't as true to who I was and money was still coming in, but it wasn't to the level which I knew I could. And so, yeah, everyone, have fun with this. Don't compare yourself to others. And seriously, and I'm, again, I'm not saying that the science isn't important, even on my own channel, I do free live, um, channel and funnel audits because the science does matter you do want to come off as professional and presentable in your niche but just don't get really caught up in the nitty gritties it's good to get feedback so feel free to sign up for the channel reviews but that's exactly what i teach in my accelerator i do teach strategy but that's only 20 percent of the pie 80 percent is being true to who you are showing up for yourself taking care of yourself taking care of your health is what matters and doing what feels in alignment for you so that's what I teach her. And if that's you, if that's what you want to do, go ahead and drop a hashtag I'm a creator down below and feel free to sign up for the channel reviews and to apply for the accelerator. I'd be glad to help you in your journey, in your process. Thanks everyone for watching and I'll see you for the next one.